What's up guys, welcome to the Comar Project, and today, woo buddy, ha ha, today is the day. What day is it, Bart? Today is the day we finish the miter station. That's right, that big monstrosity behind me, that is going to be the pallet miter station. Well, it's not made out of pallets, so I don't know if you can call it a pallet miter station, but it's gonna be veneered with pallets. Whoa! And that's what makes it really cool. It's gonna be new, but old. Yeah! I am reclaiming a top for this thing from another bench, which is gonna be awesome because it's old and beat up and yeah, it looks pretty cool. So here, let me show you what's going on, all right? It is 19 feet long. It's gonna house this awesome Bosch saw. It's got, check this out. <gasps> Transformer arm. Yeah. So let's get the top down here and take it apart and rebuild it. Miter station build now. My neighbor Rick helped me. Thanks, Ricky. This should be fun. Let's start breaking this bad boy down. Hey, we're getting there. We're only like a quarter of the way down. Okay. <laughs> oh. Ow. That hurt. Dead spiders. They're dead now. Stupid spiders. I love spiders. I have a pet spider named Walter. He lives right over there in my window. I feed him moths and flies when I catch them. Walter, the spider, her friends. That didn't work. Oh no! I broke it. Aww. I wasn't gonna use that piece anyways. I see it is this thing is absolutely perfect the way it is. What? What's up? <laughs> Did you guys get this out? Weird. But going back to what I was saying about the top, it's absolutely perfect. There's nothing wrong with it. The little paint, the dirt, and all that stuff it just adds characters. Yeah, this right here. Somebody may look at this thing and say, this is old and shouldn't be used in a new project. But you know what? The way I see it is, this is history. Somebody put in the time and the effort a long time ago to build this and build this very, very well. And why can't I reuse it in my shop, you know? I don't care what anybody else says. I like it, and I'm keeping it.
Believe it or not, this is my first time using the Domino. <laughs> like, successfully. Yeah. Unsuccessfully, like three or four times. those days or like weeks where you haven't showered? <sighs> nah, I'm good. <laughs> Not even close. <laughs> All I gotta do is just throw in a couple dominoes. We're good, guys. We're good. Finally done. Oh, oh, look how big this thing is. I can sleep here. I use a pillow. Gotta clean it. Oh, this top looks gorgeous. Yes. Reclaimed top from a reclaimed bench. You know what? It makes me feel really good to save something that served somebody for so many years and now it's gonna be part of me, part of what I do. That means a lot. But time has finally come to veneer this bad boy. And what we're gonna use is pallet wood. We're gonna cut it all up like a ninja. No, not like a ninja. Yeah, we're just gonna cut it all up on the table saw. We're gonna make faces for the drawers and then glue it and staple it, glue it and nail it. I don't know, I haven't figured that part out yet. Glue, staple, I don't know. Let's just go, all right? <laughs> Stains, some sealers, I don't know. I don't know. Figure it out, I guess, as we go. This will be fun. I promise. I'm gonna do is I'm gonna lay out all the planks on here, rearrange them how I want them, and then glue and staple them onto this half inch plywood. So that way, it will have a continuation of pallet wood. Then what we're gonna do is rip these to the size of the face of the drawers. That's gonna work, but it's gonna look kinda cool, I think. I don't know. We'll see. I'm a bit nervous. It's a good idea though, right? Yeah, sure.
<laughs> Can't even tell who's there. Magic. Loving how this is turning out. It's all reclaimed the top, the pallet wood. There's some barn wood in there too that I stole from a barn that was falling apart. So let's finish this thing. station turned out absolutely gorgeous. It took me a little bit longer than I thought, but I'm in love with it. And now I have to build the top portion, which is going to be video number three. So make sure you hit subscribe and the bell notification so that you don't miss the upcoming videos. Thank you for joining me on my experience. I had a blast building this thing and having a ton of shenanigans. Thank you again for watching. I will see you guys next time.